Don't forget to like and subscribe to the video. If you like The Matrix and you want more content like this, call me, my house phone. Like and subscribe to our channel, Hive Mind. Comment, Graydon's better than Keanu Reeves. Should have been in The Matrix too. Chill guy. Uh -huh. I mean, we know what we're dealing with. A loose cannon. And right now we're a loose cannon, as in we can't get a single one right. Sorry. Just reminded me of my pal Lou, who was like a Civil War reenactor growing up. Oh, you lose cannon. Nah, he yeah. had a cannon in his backyard, and he used to launch himself out of it into a big net that was in my backyard until I moved out. And I took the net with me, and Lou shot himself into the next yard, and the new neighbors, they kind of had a spike garden. We all lose friends, if you think about it. He was such a good guy. Let me roll it to ya. We all live in a yellow submarine. <laughs> he was a day tripper. <laughs> One day it burned her. She took me too far. Find out. I found out. <laughs> My G. Put Blade in Titanic 2. Titanic 2, the boat's rising? Uh -huh. <laughs> it's out of the water? <laughs> it's floating into the sky? Is that the MF in Titanic? <laughs> you gotta grind for that, come. Sorry. Oh god. Drop and give me 50, Weaver. Have you heard my new song? Don't start now. Smash it. <laughs> me and the baby. I took the baby off the song and then the label said put him back on there. I'm gonna need to see faster feet, Weaver. <laughs> Weaver, rate my Met Gala fit out of 10. <laughs> was I slain? <laughs> Some say it was safe, but I thought it was elegant. It's archive Chanel. You're not gonna get better than that. <laughs> Oh, I put a one already next to mine. I guess I was seeing the future. Huh. I'm seeing future next month. Are you really? Yeah. Where? Rolling Loud uh, North Pole. Rolling Loud North Pole? Tro! <laughs> That's where I'm seeing it. They're doing a Rolling Loud North Pole. North Pole. Yeah, I'm about to get crazy with some elves. <laughs> <laughs> You think the elves are gonna be there? If you sleep with them, you become immortal. <laughs> if you sleep, what, what do you mean? Wait, 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 wait. You mean sleep with them like- Procreate? Oh my gosh, okay. <laughs> and you become immortal, not like your child, your spawn? Troll. <laughs> I, I'm so confused. What? Yep. So wait. Rolling Loud North Pole. <laughs> so you're going to Rolling Loud North Pole specifically to try to procreate no. with elves to no. become immortal? Or are you no. just giving me a fact? Yeah, I'm just letting you know if I am so lucky to be involved in one of the legendary elf orgies of Rolling Loud North Pole. It's kind of like Burning Man, but with snow. <laughs> and there's like a freaky dome that you can go into and get freaky. A freaky dome? Yeah, that's what it's like at Burning Man. There's like a dome. No, I know. The I just, orgy yeah. dome. Everyone knows the notorious orgy dome, but it's like that. I guess it's kind of an igloo, you could say. <laughs> You're right. going the freaky elf igloo and you get all sorts of... And then, bang, <laughs> next thing you know, you get to live forever. <laughs> Unless you die in combat. You can die in combat. Is everyone, they can't rob you of a hero's death. <laughs> so, so, so that's you, always you, you can only die valiantly. <laughs> Correct. Oh, so it's kind of like that thing of when you either die a hero or you live long enough to see yourself become a villain. Sure. I just re-upped on my Polo G guess and got it wrong. That's a bummer, dude. Now if Polo G shows up, I'm gonna look like a I'm gonna look like a a, a silly stupid Sally. Yeah, you're gonna look like a like a dumb da dumb Derek. I'm like a dumb ditz Derek. Dumb ditz Derek. I'm gonna I'm gonna look like a ridiculous Ricky wrong answer. You're gonna look like a whimsical, witless Wayne. You know who I look like? <laughs> you, you look like? Yeah. You don't get to say that. Jake Tapper. Mm. <laughs> CNN. Yeah. yeah. Kind of. Like I'm really hot to like moms. Uh, why'd you wink at me? Huh? <laughs> I don't like that. Why'd you wink at me? What do you mean? That could mean a lot of things. What do you mean? You gotta understand. Winking to me is like a... Like, should I fight Grant? What are you trying to tell me? <laughs> like, I'm, I'm just saying, like, I, I'm attractive to older women. You know what I mean? What do you want me to do, though? Huh? A wink is usually, like, a command you for don't something that's any. not spoken. You don't have to do anything. Like, you can just, oh, oh, wait, you want me to fight Grant? See? You know what I mean? <laughs> I see myself as a little goblin who lives kind of in a hole in the mountain. <sighs> <laughs> and I'm friends with bats and lizards, and I eat raw snails right out of the shells. <laughs> That's what I see myself as, but they say I have something. I see myself as a movie star waiting to happen. That's what I tell myself in the mirror every single morning. I say, hey, what's up, Ryan Sheckler? Oh, yeah, I know him. Hit an ollie. Golfer. That's what I say in the mirror. Go, Goblin. Go, Goblin. I'll say that to myself sometimes. Go, go <laughs> I'll say, you got this today, you little fucking freaky Goblin. I'll say, go, Goblin. I'll dance in the mirror like this. <laughs> Ha <laughs> ha!
Ready to conquer the day. <laughs> Give me another snail. Stuff like that. <laughs> Do goblins canonically eat snails? <laughs> I don't know. It makes sense though, right? Right. They like, live in like a wet cave and there's little snails like... Not little snails, actually. I take that back. Big snails. Gigantic, disgusting snails. <laughs> and then you just... Ooh. Ah. And that fuels you. That makes sense. Ooh, I had an idea for the show, by the way, to make it better. Yeah. I want to release like a bunch of small animals kind of like on the table and just let them kind of do their thing. Little the lizards, lizards and yeah. stuff. Snails. Lizards, rodents, snails. Snails are a good one because they uh -huh. won't get too far. So they're <laughs> yeah. in the frame for a while. <laughs> what if we just had two snails and they kind of raced across as the show went on and <laughs> fans could like live bet on them? Oh, there's a, <laughs> there's a snail cam? Yes. <laughs> a little snail cam like halfway through the video. They're here. One's like just a little ahead. If it gets hot at the end, we'll pause for the action of Oh, like, yeah, we'll be like, uh, let's check in on the snail race real quick. <laughs> go, go, go. We and may. if one falls off and dies, he wins. <laughs> Why? Death is the finish line. Oh, I guess it is. <laughs> Download some snails for us. <laughs> I don't know. What's the word for... What's it in real life? When you don't get it off the internet, there's like a... Um... Upload? Oh, buy. Yeah, buy, buy. Yeah, buy, yeah. I heard buy, my yeah. parents say that. Mm -hmm, you buy it. Yeah. I'm just joking around, guys. The world will end soon. Tom York, right? Tom York, yeah, he's the singer of Radiohead. Is that what you're asking? Tom York, right? Yeah, I guess. Elon Musk has a cat's penis. <laughs> yeah. Well, I went with Burger King because I want it that way. Oh, oh yeah. yeah. Hey, okay. okay. That yeah, makes yeah, fucking point. sense, doesn't it? And doesn't I, went with, I went with Cracker Barrel because there's a lot of crackers on the playlist. <laughs> yeah, a lot of whites. <laughs> yeah. Stop cuck shaming. Yeah. That's what I will say. Yeah. Stop it. We need them. Stop cuck shaming. <laughs> That would be awesome <laughs> if like reverse inflation happened. What is reverse inflation? Is that outflation? I guess. Yeah, that's probably what it's called. But yeah, that would be sick. Like if you were going to buy like a pair of shoes and they were like, all right, that'll be eight bucks. Yeah. We just made the minimum wage $4, but $4 is technically like $100. If minimum wage was $100 though? Wow, well, yeah. yeah. <laughs> I'd probably work at like a Ben and Jerry's or something. Oh, yeah. I'd work at like an ice cream shop. I could see you scooping. <laughs> oh, that'd be so fun. They're always like, you get to play a little music in there. It's like a safe place to be overly friendly. Friendly. Ooh, what are we getting today, you little bad boys and girls? What do we want to eat? A little <laughs> don't don't drop it. I'm just kidding. If you do, I'll give you another one. Who cares? Minimum wage is hundred dollars. Or I'd hunt narwhals. Th what? Th that's that seems at odds. <laughs> that's another that fun, thing. silly little job where like it's also a safe place to be goofy. Now narwhals are not extinct yet. No, they seem like they would be. <laughs> totally right? They don't be. seem like they exist. Yeah, if you harvest enough of their horns, though, what happens, <laughs> brother? I got something to tell you. Please tell me. This is getting <laughs> it's amazing. You don't know. Why would it's you like make me ancient, feel this stupid? It's, it's just like, like an ancient, not like everyone should know this. Well, please tell me. Do you really want to know? Yes, obviously I do. You can unlock the perfect jump shot. You've never heard this? <laughs> this is how Ray Allen's dad kind of like anointed him with 45 narwhal horns. And that's how he got that laser sharp three point shot. Are you, this is news to you? I mean, I'm a basketball fan and I'm also curious about sea life and I had zero idea that this L was a thing. Literally in the good book, it says, lay the baby upon the pile of the narwhal horns and the blessed jumper shall be upon them. That's why I'd be a narwhal hunter. It'd be so fun. Yeah, yeah. I guess. So who is a little narwhal? Could you? Give <laughs> 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 that horn. Whoa, wait a minute. Where'd they go? Oh, okay. Hey. Go watch Air, Ben Affleck's new movie with best friend, childhood fat friend, Ben Matt Damon. You're always <laughs> plugging a, a weird movie on here. That's not a weird movie, it's a fucking smasher. 100% rotten tease. Really? Yeah. Did you see it yet? No, no. I'm dying to. <laughs> I would love to see that yeah. movie with you on yeah. a date. I really want to pirate it, though. I don't want to give money to Ben Affleck. What if we just snuck into the theater? I love that idea. Because I, would, pay... I want to go out. I'm so sick. Every night we stay at home, we order yeah. Chinese, and it's like, I just- he the blanket. Exactly. Yeah. Sometimes I just want to go out. Sometimes just take me out. It's like you're ashamed of me or something. <laughs> I'm worried I'll run into one of my other boyfriends. One I only have one girlfriend. I have lots of boyfriends. That's okay. That's okay. As That's... long as I'm the one. What about solidarity? We're solidarity. both partners here. Why? What? This is crazy. Well, I figure like we got together first. So whoever else comes after, I sort of get like first pick. First? first choice. Well, you and me were platonic for a long time. Okay. For a lot, for the first five years. And yeah. then we had 11 years of pure romance. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. Jesus. <laughs> My bad, brother. My name's Dignan. I'm absolutely uncorked. And I'm unbridled with the love I feel for Big Sean. My trip to Dolly World is something I'll remember for the rest of my life. Regardless of if you choose me or Jane Delico for to be your lover. 
<laughs> you know what I mean? That'd be like, why? Yeah, wait a minute. Why? I, was that Joe or was that Dignan? Yeah, it's yeah. almost like projecting or saying the things you're not confident enough to say. Totally. With the guise of someone else. Yeah, that's like if I said, you want to hear my Nicolas Cage impression? Yeah. You know, I've always dealt with uh, a crippling self-doubt. That, <laughs> Be not fooled by my charm and my, you know, behind that is a scared man. I wear a happy mask and there is a man who's crying behind it. You've seen the memes. But someday, me, Riley Savage, I hope to overcome it, you know? Yeah. I grew up in Sylvania, Ohio. <laughs> yeah, that's it. yeah. My parents are still together. Yeah, they are. I played baseball and basketball growing up. <laughs> And my sister's name is Meredith, my brother's name is Keegan, and my uncle is Tony Hawk. And you don't live in Las Vegas, do you? I do not live in Las Vegas. I have never been in a movie. What is that? Huh? It's coffee. Starbucks. Who's that on the cover? What? Who is that? It's just like a, their logo, I guess. It's like a mermaid woman. <laughs> Turn it away. What? Turn it away. Are you flirting with the <laughs> girl stop. in the Starbucks cup? Dude. Turn it away. Just stop. I'm getting distracted. <laughs> what? <laughs> what the hell? She's this... so pretty. What? <laughs> you have a crush on the Starbucks logo? Stop. <laughs> Dude. No, no. This is... You think I can get a word in after the video? You can talk to a cup after the video. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> yes. <laughs> I can't not laugh at it. He's Here's me digging your grave. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, my foot fetish is getting out of hand. <laughs> Are you blowing your nose in your shirt? You wanna see my impression of a guitar solo? Yeah. <laughs> oh, wow, sorry. I thought it was at like an outdoor venue there. Oh, baby! <laughs> That's her deal. This is my impression of a whole rock show. Uh -huh. Yeah, I love that song! Woo! Yeah! I don't know, some young guy next to me just passed it to me. <laughs> I haven't done this since the 80s. Why'd you take me here? Seriously, I don't even <laughs> like this band. It's always about your interests, it's never about mine. What do you mean the beer's $8? Just kidding, I'll have six of them. <laughs> Yo, what's up? I think I can get you backstage. I followed him after college for a few months. <laughs> Sorry, I always I get really bad allergies to these shows. I don't know what it is. You want to bite of my soft pretzel? They got soft pretzels here? Where'd you get this? Oh, they don't have them here. You brought them? You brought, <laughs> it's from the Buffett show last weekend. Oh, really? There's, yeah. Why'd they sell pretzels at the Buffett show? I don't know. There's a guy there. Pretty good though, right? It tastes pretty good for being a week old, <laughs> honestly. <laughs> Oh, Jesus! Our fans don't give a fuck. <laughs> they literally don't. That's one thing about High Mind fans is they don't give a fuck, dude. Almost like one of these. Hey, yo, society. A typical High Mind fan, here's my impression. Dude, I literally don't give a fuck. Not gonna put me in a box. <laughs> Can't come to work today, I pissed in my shoes. <laughs> yeah, I live in Detroit and I pissed in my shoes. You have an eyelash. <laughs> <laughs> Seems like there are better ways to do that. Got it. But your hands were wet. <laughs> they were soft. Is what you meant to say. <laughs> I didn't say soft, I said wet. You meant to say soft. I don't think so. You meant to say soft, and that actually surprised you how nice it felt when my hand caressed your eyes. Was it like sweat or lotion or water? Lotion. Squirt? <laughs> it was lotion. I meant the soda, by the way. Get your minds out of the gutter. It was Great lotion. Fruit flavored soda, squirt. It's delicious. It was lotion. Okay, cool. That's That makes me feel better. That's actually the best of the options, I yes. think. Unless it's a lotion that reacts poorly with my other lotion and starts a chemical reaction on my face. It was your lotion, so. <laughs> oh, nice. Don't steal my lotion anymore. <laughs> okay. The tone reminded me of Big Sean. Big Sean. Yeah. Wow. I love Big Sean. Did no. you know that? Really? Yeah. <laughs> wow. I am. I didn't think I'd get the opportunity to proclaim my love for Big Sean, but here I am sitting on the throne with a crowd of hundreds of thousands of people listening to me, and I'm going to scream it from the rooftops. Okay. Go up there. I love Big Sean. <laughs> 
I love you. No one's ever made me feel this way. I'll do anything for you. I'm just crazy about you. Thank you, Sean. Big Sean, I love you. <laughs> Can I ask you a question? What? What do you love about him? I love your cornrows and that you're much, much shorter than me and that your bars are so witty and that you left your wife for me. I love you, Big Sean. And thanks for taking me to Dolly World. What the hell? <laughs> Big Sean took me to Dolly World. I super liked him on Tinder. That was our first date. He is rich as fuck. Let me tell you. He flew my, he flew my yeah. ass out on a PJ straight to Dolly World. Next thing you know, we're riding wooden roller coasters through the woods. <laughs> Me and Sean, hand in hand. We were ducking and diving from the paparazzi all day, but eventually, love wins. <laughs> By the time guess, this video yeah. comes out, I'm sure the relationship will be public. So. <laughs> I'm pretty comfortable with everything I've said and done. So far, so you can just send that out there, and I'm sure it will not spoil our budding romance. I thought he was with Janae Iko. She left her because she doesn't like Dolly World. <laughs> but me, on the other hand, fuck, I'm obsessed with that place. Holy shit, I got an airbrush t shirt, Dolly World on it. Used it as a rag later on accident, but I got it. Um, sorry, I know you're busy, but. <laughs> Um, say something! It's literally a vector graphic. Like it's not a person. <gasps> she said yes. She did not say anything. She said cut. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yes. I can't wait to go to prom with you, my new wife. I mean, we'll take it slow. My new girlfriend. <laughs> Jesus Christ. I got it. And I'd like to take this time to thank our sponsor, Harry Styles. <laughs> Without you, Harry, none of this would be possible. Harry Styles sponsored this video? Yes. I didn't know that. Say thank you to Harry. Thank you, Harry. What was less, that? Where did that voice come from? Flirtatious. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> My voice is weird. I might work with him someday. <laughs> I don't want to start off on the wrong foot. Right. Start off on a cold foot. Um, <laughs> are there any talking points Shoulder for me first. about Harry? Yes. They're right there on the prompt. Go ahead. Oh, okay. Harry Styles, not only are you a talented musician, but your first foray into acting was a marvelous success and bewildered the youth? Correct. Bewildered the youth. Yep. It's, I don't... It's Good odd line. wording, but yeah, okay. And if... Oh, God, it's so, say it. it's so small. Just say it. Okay. And I know one thing. If Harry Styles is sponsoring the video, it can only go one direction. Okay. Great. Oh, Great. God, he, I can't the, believe he put that in there. Yeah, now the weird. call to action. The call to action. Okay. That cannot be right. It is. Just oh, say it. All right. We're getting paid a lot for this one. Okay. Here we go. Go to verizonwireless.com and use code Harry Styles. Mm -hmm. Where, why shouldn't we be the code? Why no, is he no. the code? He's the code. Usually the code's about our channel. It's I like know. for our. Okay. I requested that it Whatever. Was Harry use Styles. code Harry Styles for 100% off a new iPhone. <laughs> wow. It seems insane, but. Mm. Are you sure this is the real Harry Styles? Where'd you get this inquiry? Email. Email? Yeah. And it was from like the official Harry team or? It said Harry's team dot com. <laughs> <laughs> All right, whatever. I trust it. Yeah, me too. I love his music. Wow, I'm getting absolutely skunk fucked right now. <laughs> Have you ever been sprayed by a skunk? <clears throat> no. Like legit caught a good spray? No, but I used to smoke so much loud that people thought that yeah. often. I'd yeah. walk into the party and they go, you get skunk fucked today? <laughs> <laughs> I got annihilated by one broad daylight on a golf course. I like found it under a tree and it like hit me and I was like, well, I'm screwed already, so I'm gonna take it out on this skunk. And I chased it around. Cross people, they're like hitting, I'm chasing a skunk with my putter, like trying to smack it. I corner it to like its home tree. Turns around again, sprays me again. I was like dripping in skunk juice. And I sat in a baby pool. My mom put a baby pool in the tomato front yard. Juice. Tomato juice and like vinegar. Yep. She said, get your ass in there. Throw your clothes out. Never come back to my house smelling like that again. Oh, man. Yeah. She was married to Pepe Le Pew before she met my dad, so it was a very sensitive thing for her. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, but I'm still here today, so anybody can do it. You can survive a skunk spray. I thought it could have been Whoopty for a second. I love that song. Whoopty, walked in, blue cheese. Yeah. Look at my hands, poopy. <laughs> Poopy. Yeah, I'm addicted to poopy. <laughs> poop play. <laughs> I'm addicted to poop play. Shit stains. <laughs> yeah, I'm addicted to shit stains. <laughs> shit stains. Yeah, I'm addicted to shit stains. <laughs>
I want to be in the ocean where I can't see land. Oh, I would be terrified of that. Really? I do not like that. No. I want to go whale watching. Oh, I've seen whales. Really? Yeah. What kind of whales? I don't know. It killer too, whale? Too far away. Not Because they're whale. actually porpoises. Yeah, it wasn't that. Mm -hmm. It was a whale, but it was very far away, so mm -hmm. I didn't see that. But I've been kayaking with dolphins. Really? My dream is to go swimming with dolphins, but I was just kayaking and You're they were going. You're messed up. Why? You just want to... No, I do not. Yes, you no, do. No, you've been reading too much of that book. The no. Wet Goddess book. Don't mention that online. We can't talk about it. It's a banned book. The only banned book I ever liked was the Beatles biography. No, I'm just The Bruce Springsteen doc. <laughs> Did you really? Don't get Sorry. that. Don't let that Don't one get in there. there. <laughs> <laughs> white rabbits, white rabbits. Look, I'm Michael Jordan. Shut <laughs> the ball like that. Here goes Michael. Brick. <laughs> Kobe. <laughs> what if the announcers in a tennis match made a sound for every single time the ball gets hit? Bink? <laughs> yeah, they're like, bink, and he's had a great day today. He's really moving around. Boink? <laughs> like, just trying to fit it in there. Blamp. Or there's like three guys. It's like play-by-play, -play, color commentary, and sound effects guy. <laughs> Onomatopoeia man. <laughs> yeah. Whoosh, whoosh. A guy's like, oh yeah, I'm an announcer for professional tennis. And they're like, oh, do you do play-by-play -play or color? And he's like, I'm the Onomatopoeia man. <laughs> so I hit him with the thwack. <laughs> cool. You're the voink guy. Oh no. I think I'm gonna throw up. <laughs> <laughs> Swallow it. <laughs> Swallow it. Oh no. Oh no. Ah, <laughs> 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 uh, I drank too much crystal Pepsi earlier. Yeah. I saved it from when they were still selling it the first time. So. <laughs> yeah, so it's not good anymore. I don't know. I thought it would be fine. No, it's not. It tasted fine, but... Just because crystals last forever doesn't mean the Pepsi would. <laughs> oh, oh, gee, there's some velocity behind that one. Plug your nose. It wants to come out so bad. Dignan getting in your head a little bit here, bud? I think so, honestly. It's a big part of Dignan's game. Mind games. And speaking in the third person. <laughs> Dignan actually likes prison. <laughs> oh, really? Oh, yeah. yeah. Dignan's meeting a lot of friends in there. A lot of good people. Yeah? Yeah. <laughs> a lot of friends of my parents. My parents themselves. <laughs> Haven't seen them in a very long time. And they're in prison. They're my bunk mates. Really? Yes. Whoa. What are the odds? <laughs> oh, no, they do it by last names. Yeah, <laughs> yeah pretty, <laughs> pretty good odds. Yeah, actually, good odds. Yep. There's one thing you guys want to know as an update. Diggy's a Swifty. Well, it's hard not to be. Yeah, he got really into the what he thinks is the new album. It's a re-recorded album from 10 years ago. <laughs> Brand new, baby. It's not new. It's though. all about right now. It's also topical. Yeah. She talks about pulling out of Afghanistan. She talks about Ugh. inflation. She talks about the stolen ballots of Michigan and Virginia. She talks about all sorts of stuff. She talks about Boris Johnson a little bit in there. <laughs> really? Um, she starts in on the famine in Madagascar, which I thought was so, 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 so brave of a songwriter of her caliber to even step into a realm like that. But it's just like, wow, wow. When I listen to that record, it's like, wow. You know? Yeah, I guess. The oh, scarf right. is kind of an allegory for inflation. Uh, oh, really? Yeah. Like, the monetary value and the control of the U.S. dollar has been taken from her, but she knows where it is. <laughs> she just <laughs> can't get it back. Jake Gyllenhaal's like China. It's phenomenal. <laughs> 10 out of 10. I have seen, like, six movies total. I know. This one of them's Napoleon Dynamite. One yeah. of them's Donnie Darko. So if those are in here, I'm, I'm good. I'm probably going to lose this game, though. Yeah. Um, I see what you're doing, trying to, like, lull me into a false sense of security, mm -hmm. but I'm not going to fall for it. I'm going to stay focused and keep plowing on. I've not seen very many movies. I've not seen very many movies. I guess one point will be good enough for me to win. I've not <laughs> seen too many movies. You're a frog. <laughs> You owe me $50. <laughs> Thank you. All right. Let's get to the second one. Oh, <laughs> wait. Are we still Are we still on? Yeah, we're still filming. We're oh, good. okay. I don't know what I'm doing anymore, dude. Dude, you're still funny. You still got it. Despite what everyone on Reddit's saying. <laughs> Look at me. I'm a hamster. No, oh, jeez. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Party rock is in the house tonight. <laughs> I don't know, dude. I'm just like phoning it in. Here's another joke. You're welcome. <laughs> Three, two, one. Trippy Red, New York Mayor Bill de Blasio. It's 
This one is gonna. Dang it! Uh, Drop a blood or crip down in the comments if you're one of the two. <laughs> <laughs> if you're one of the two, just let us know. <laughs> okay, cool. <laughs> ah, the tickles! <laughs> <laughs> All right. All right. And remember, Uncle Phil and Aunt Linda got a divorce. Do not bring up Aunt Linda to Uncle Phil. Okay. Linda, where's Uncle Phil? No, stop it. <laughs> oh yeah. Stop it. Okay. Okay. I'm serious. You gotta be good. Did they make the chess pie? Yes, they made the pie. You love it. <laughs> That's fine. We'll have that after. Quit tickling me. Okay. I'm not even tickling you. <laughs> hey. All right. And you gotta be quiet. <laughs> Be quiet during mass, okay? Oh, 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 can I play my Game Boy? No, you cannot. Please! Oh my gosh. Can I get a new game after this if I'm quiet? You know what? Yes. <laughs> if you're quiet through the entire mass, uh -huh. and you don't say Aunt Linda even one time. Can Grandma Ethel do Reiki on me? Woo, woo, woo! Uh-oh. <laughs> <laughs> Gotta go! <laughs> ding, 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 I'm stupid for the rest of the video. <laughs> Is it the wrong answer? <laughs> oh, man. God, dude. <laughs> Remember not to go down on your girlfriend. She doesn't deserve it. That is inspiring. Oh, come on. <laughs> I'm still, I've kind of turned a page on the whole. <laughs> oh, that is really inspirational. <laughs> Gosh. Here I go, puking in my mouth. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, let's get it in here. There it goes. That's what a lasso sounds like, right? <laughs> what are you laughing at? <laughs> I'm just picturing those squirrels when they make them water ski. <laughs> That's just so sick. <laughs> you ever seen like a bulldog skateboard? <laughs> Yeah. Why is it always a bulldog? They're like the skaters of the dog yeah. world. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. They seem a little chunky to be skateboarding. It's never a dachshund. Like a Pomeranian seems like the right size. Maybe even a pug. I don't know. Or like when those raccoons ride those little tricycles. <laughs> that is my favorite. I love when a raccoon rides a tricycle. <laughs> How'd they get thumbs though? I don't know. That seems weird that they got thumbs and everyone else got shafted on thumbs. Yeah, I feel like they're God's second favorite. I kind of snapped with these guys. <laughs> I'm gonna give them thumbs and an insatiable hunger for trash. <laughs> they are gonna love trash and they're gonna be able to pick stuff up. I was gonna guess bankroll Hayden. Uh, again? <laughs> Doesn't sound anything like his production, but also you are obsessed with that guy, man. I've heard a lot of his unreleased music. You are gonna be underwhelmed. Un oh, okay. I, I don't even think I'm gonna hear it, to be honest. For sure you will. I'm gonna show you later. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I guess. stole it off his hard drive. You say a lot of stuff on camera that just is like. I stole bankroll Hayden's unreleased catalog and later I want to share it with you and I'm a monster? Didn't call you a monster. I don't deserve love. I'm just saying, why are you like snitching on yourself? Like bankroll Hayden watches every single video. We both know that. He's going to see yeah. that and he's not going to trust you anymore. It's just like, why would you blow your cover so obviously? Because I've been praying every day pretty much since his stardom was born that he would try me. And so I'm antagonizing him to go ahead. But you love his mute. Why are you antagonizing your favorite artist? It draws closer together inevitably. I don't see how that's going to work. I feel like we're kind of like a Pumbaa and Timon type scenario. Mm, they usually say Timon and Pumbaa. Kind of one of those, like, you shouldn't say it backwards sort of deal. <laughs> I did. Yeah. I'm Pumbaa. That's why I said it. You're Pumbaa and I'm Timon? Yeah. You're taller than me. But I want to be a little warthog. Is that your impression of Pumbaa? Oh, hey, I'm a little warthog. Here I go. Wallowing in the mud again. Oh, come on. That doesn't sound anything like Pumbaa. The trick is warthogs don't move their mouths when they talk. It's like a ventriloquist. Hey, Timon, you trying to go hang out with Simba again? We're going to eat some grub. You know what I'm talking about? That's my Pumbaa. So he's like a tough Brooklyn guy? Uh, no, he's more of a warthog from oh. that Lion King movie. Yeah. Okay. Those hyena dudes, I'm telling you, they're kind of cool. Maybe we should hang out with those guys, huh? Hey, Rafiki, you bozo, end your life. <laughs> My grandma was so cringe, dude. <laughs> really? My grandma was super cringe. <laughs> Jeez. <laughs> Straight up. She was like reverse pog, like mm. mega cringe, like dude. Like, she's like a cringe lord, dude. <laughs> dude, she's super cringe, dude. <laughs> My grandma's so cringe. Hey, face up. <laughs> face up, grandma. Joaquin penis, more like it. <laughs> what? Joaquin Phoenix. Yeah, no, I get it. The joke was I replaced Phoenix with penis. Oh, like the penis sons. <laughs> or Harry Potter and the Order of the Penis. <laughs> Genius. <laughs> it's unbelievable comedy. That's yeah. like a place no one's ever taken jokes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like Ben Affleck has that huge penis tattoo on his back. <laughs> yeah. 
<laughs> that is unbelievable territory we just wandered into. You can go to any bar in town, they're playing Blady all night long. <laughs> Echo 2K, Tie Boy Digital, I mean all night long. We, it was a real barn burner last night. We turned up to Ice Dancer all the way through. DJ let the album play front to back. Woo-wee! I'll tell you what, we were draining harder than a, than a squirrel in a pickle barrel. <laughs> <laughs> My dad don't get the music. But I tell him, shut up, Paul. It's Drain Gang. <laughs> Rip Squad. <laughs> I was grinding on my cousin to Blady. Sorry, I don't want <laughs> We got it right over there, dude. Oh. Uh, hi, yeah, <laughs> how have you been? <laughs> you know, things are, things are good. Busy. <laughs> Super busy. Oh, yeah. Are you still doing D-pop? That's cool. <laughs> yeah. You really changed your tune. You were flirting a lot before. We already hooked up. It wasn't good for either of us. Oh, okay. She gave me an STI. Well, uh, there you go. Wrap it up. One venti chlamydia, please. <laughs> <laughs>